What's up guys, my name is Jess with no BS, transport passives and all the other passives, combat, support, whatnot. Let's get into it. So for number one, transport. These are for the pass pals who transport during day and night. For the ones that are uh, not dark, not nocturnal, you gotta slap on nocturnal. For the ones that are dark, put on nimble. When it comes to base work, uh, depending on their work speed, would dictate how fast a task gets done. This goes for handiwork, planting, farming, logging, uh, generating electricity, farming, whatnot. So, this is the NAWS. N-A-W-S means Nocturnal, Artisan, Workslave, and Serious. You get a 100% work speed bonus, okay? So keep that in mind. Up on the top are the stats that you want to try and uh, keep in uh, mind as well. When it comes to the Dark Pals, you don't need to put on Nocturnal. Now you put Unlucky in place of it. So it goes laws. Now you have a maximum of 115% work speed. When it comes to the breeding, which is known as spam breeding, this means that this helps you get to the next ascension, to four stars and whatnot. Philanthropist and Nocturnal, they breed twice as fast, and they breed during nighttime, okay? I have about eight, eight of these farms, give or take, to spam my uh, Anubis. Now when it comes to support pals, these are the ideal passes that you want to go. You want to go find first and noble for the money, vanguard and strong host strategist for the bonus stats. On screen, you see the uh, the amount of uh, gold we can get as an increase, forty percent more gold, which is pretty dang impressive, to be honest. It's it's not mandatory for the fine first and noble, but to put them onto a gobfin, which is even better. Okay, on screen, I have a video talking about this whole thing in, more in depth. So yeah, when it comes to mounts, um, Legend Swift and Runner are the go-to for movement speeds of sixty-five percent. Um, when it comes to infinite stamina, it gives you more sprint, but if you don't want that, just slot on nimble. These are the same exact passives as transport pals, just without nocturnal, because that's useless because you're riding them, right? Good. Now, let's get into some combat. Okay, for combat, um, there are standard or regular stats where you go legend ferocious, musclehead, plus serenity now. Right? People used to go Legend Serenity or Legend Musclehead Ferocious with Burly Body for the raw stats, but now that Serenity's out, you go for the CDR. Now, when it comes to pals that possess an element or that you'd like to put on an element, these are the normal passes that you go. Legend, Serenity, Musclehead plus the element. I call it Element LSM, LSI, LSF, right? The LSM means Legend, Serenity, Musclehead, so get you know used to those uh, terminologies and whatnot and you're in for a nice ride, right? Uh, you see how I have lots of different elements on certain uh, different pals and whatnot. Uh, sometimes they apply to their its own passive or its own element or type, rather. Um, so yeah, uh, there is something known as STAB, S-T-A-B, which really just means single target ability bonus and certain elements have heightened damage boosts. Now, when it comes to multi-elements, you can, in fact, slot on multi-elements on different pals. Here I have two, plus Legend and Serenity. Here I have three, plus Serenity. And it's great for support. Now, when it comes to raids, uh, you can't put Legend on them, okay? Sad to say, but you cannot put Legend on them because they can only breed within themselves to produce the same exact pal, right? It's like today's biology, so to speak. I'm pretty sure at least. Now, when it comes to breeding, uh, it would be wise to have a naked pal so that you can crossbreed and, th and then get a different um, gender and whatnot. And then there's also doubles, which is two passives. You see, you go two passive plus two passive equals four passives on the baby, right? Or you can go four passives plus zero passives equals four passives on the baby. Three passives plus one passes equals four on the baby. You know, that sort of gist. And then there's triads, this is a 3 passives plus 1 equals 4, right? So yeah, thanks for watching. Peace!